Now for the global coronavirus update, whereby the World Health Organization is warning the Northern Hemisphere is facing a crucial moment in fighting the coronavirus pandemic, with many countries witnessing an exponential increase in coronavirus cases. Who Director General Tedros Adhanom is now urging leaders to take immediate action to prevent further necessary deaths. <laughs> The stark warning on Friday came as the number of coronavirus cases more than doubled in 10 days across Europe, with several southern European countries reporting their highest daily case numbers this week. So far, Europe has recorded more than 7.8 million cases and about 247,000 deaths from the coronavirus pandemic. Meanwhile, the United States recorded its biggest single-day rise in infections, with more than 70,000 since July on Thursday, amid concerns over third wave of COVID-19 gripping the worst affected country in the world. WHO Director General Tedros Admon said the globe is at a critical juncture in the COVID-19 pandemic, particularly in the Northern Hemisphere. The WHO warned that the core circulation of the annual flu season in winter months and COVID-19, both of which cause respiratory illness, could place an additional burden on the vulnerable populations and healthcare systems that are already stretched because of the pandemic. Tedros said too many countries were now seeing an exponential increase in infections and that is now leading to hospitals and intensive care units running close to above capacity. Following months, long lockdowns and border closures, countries have gradually eased restrictions and reopened businesses to salvage economies crippled by the pandemic. The novel coronavirus has infected over 42 million people and killed at least 1.1 million people since the outbreak emerged in China last December, according to data collected by John Hopkins University. For Channel One News, I am Emily K. Buddy.